Let's use an apple to keep our bow fingers nice and curved. So put it in your hand, relax your hand, raise it up, level it out. So your arm and wrist are level. Let it droop, level it out so they're nice and level. Now, let's take the apple out of your hand, but let your hand stay nice and curved. Do you see how your fingers are still curved? Now, let's try putting a pencil in that hand. So that it sits on the thumb and the fingers can droop down and the pinky can sit on top, but there's still an open space. It's a small space where that apple was. Now, let's take the pencil back out, put the apple back in and show me that is nice and curved. Flip it over, your thumb is curved, flip it back, tap your pinky, and now let's try putting an actual bow in here. So pull it out, keep your fingers nice and curved. And now we're going to put a bow in here. And so the bow is pointing the same direction as your pointer finger. And the pinky sits on top and the thumb is nice and curved underneath. You can hold on over here so it doesn't make you too tired. And now let's peek. Do we still have a little bit of open space back here? We do. That's where the apple or the tennis ball kept our fingers nice and curved.